Hey guys, this is Roman on Fire. Welcome back to another tutorial video. And in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to make this item frame combination lock. This is a super awesome secure combination lock. Basically, we want this light to turn on by doing the right combination. So I'm going to look in our combination manual. And in here, it says A is 2, B is 3, and C is 5. So first, so this is one on 1, 2, it's like that. 1, 2, 3, 1, 2 two three four five like that as you can see the lamp turns on if, however if we flick one of them or get one of them wrong it will not turn on as you can see and then we just turn it back on so you can see it turns off if we do it wrong and yeah if we just kind of mess around it is not going to work so i'm just going to quickly reset these things okay so yeah that's pretty much this awesome combination it is very compact depending on how big your um combination is it really just depends because you get to pick the combination that's the best part about this thing all right so now i'm going to show you guys how to build this all you're going to need is six resin torches three repeaters um around 32 redstone i'm not exactly sure but you can need it around that much you're going to need um three comparators three item frames and blocks to build with i'm just going to use iron and nether warp blocks okay so now we can go over here and then we're just going to start building this thing. So we are going to build it so it is seven blocks long or seven blocks wide, I should say, like this. And then it needs to be three blocks tall. It doesn't have to be this exact, um, but for this tutorial, it's going to be like that. And then we can always extend it. And then we're just going to place three item frames like this and then go ahead, place um, rest some torches like this. And then they don't have to be resin torches. They can be end rods, tripwire hooks, levers, just torches, whatever. It can be any block actually, but I just use resin torches because they're easy to point out. A lot of people like to use those. So now, by the iron frames, place blocks with comparators, and then place two blocks like that, and then break that one, and then keep doing the same thing. And then now it is time for us to set our combination for our first one. So I think we are going to set ours to um, three. No, let's do set ours to four, I guess. So we already have a block, so we'd set it to four blocks like this. One, two, three, four. Since we set ours to four, and if, say, if yours was five, you'd set it to five. And now at your fourth or last block, place a resin torch like that, and then get a um, nether warp block and place a resin dust there. And then go ahead and get another one with a repeater like that and then another block with red some du dust like that sorry i was kind of stuttering a little bit so now we want to set this one to um i guess we'll set this one to three so one two three like that then go ahead and place a resin torch with the rest of dust like that and then go ahead take out some blocks some red blocks well it doesn't have to be red blocks but i'm just using those to mark to ma mark out what would the um the false passcode so now you're gonna set this one to um should we set it to two no let's set it not set to four that'd be a little easy let's set ours to five yeah let's set ours to four, five so we're gonna go ahead since we already have one here so do one two three four five and then go ahead get some red blocks out just like this and go ahead and resin dust with a um torch and then another resin dust repeater oh no not a a repeater and then rest some dust and yeah that's gonna be the first part done next up we're gonna do a bit of the um basically a bit of the mechanism so now we're gonna we're just gonna link this up to a redstone lamp you can link this up to a door um yeah just anything like it can be anything you really want it's your con it's your thing for this part so i'm just gonna go ahead and do a lamp to keep this tutorial nice and simple and then we're gonna link redstone up to this so i'm just gonna quickly put, put, put this up and then you want to go ahead what place redstone like this coming from that repeater and then you're gonna want some coming out of all of these torches and repeaters and then make sure they are all linked up to each other and then if there isn't and if it is um if you need a repeater you can always use another one so we want to link all of these resin torches together and all of these repeaters make sure you link all of them together and you need to somehow be linking up okay so now we have linked that resin torch that resin torch and then we need have we linked all of these repeaters let's see one two yep we have linked all of these so now we have linked everything up it, it is completely finished so now what I am going to do is I am actually just going to get rid of my stuff and I'm going to get a book and quilt and I'm going to write what the combination is going to be. So let's take that out. And then so then we just, you, can, you don't have to do, do a book and quilt. You can just write it on a piece of paper or yeah, or just somehow just memor, memorize it. But I would just use a book and quilt. 
but I'm actually not going to use a book and quill, I guess, because, um, yeah, let's just not do a book and quill, because that will take too long to make, so I know what I'm going to do, let's just grab some blocks, like this, where are some blocks, okay, let's just grab some gold, and then I'm just going to place these where they are, just so I don't forget. <laughs> okay, so then now I'm just gonna set these back to normal, like to where they were, and then we're gonna go ahead and test ours out. So ours was like this; it was pointing downwards like that, and this one was pointing to that gold block, and that one was pointing diagonally to that block. And then, as you can see, it's turned on. If we move one of them, it'll turn off just like that. That is awesome. Yeah, that's pretty much this combination lock. This is super handy for I don't know. You can use it for, like, maybe you can hide your diamonds in here, make it a door, um, just anything. Alright guys, that's the end of this video here. Hope you guys did all enjoy, and if you did, please like, and if you're new, please subscribe. That would really help, and I'll see you guys later. Goodbye!